Hi everybody, how you doing? It's you, it's me, I'm Grant, and you're my team. Welcome back to update number three for Project Legacia, our island town, Animal Crossing, yay! This is fun. I've already done a little bit of playing today, so there's no big like, oh hi, I'm Isabel, I've got an update. So we're just gonna skip that. What we're going to do is we're gonna try and condense, because uh, I know that the last couple of episodes have been long, and I am not okay with that. I would like to try and condense things down because then I can actually get something out on the day it's meant to go up. So let's just take a quick tour of the island and see what's what and what's new and what's updated. So nothing much has really changed here. I have a pool. I have a bayonet to bed. Hey. <laughs> It's really cute. We have roses and everything, and I don't know if you caught a little glimpse of that, but yes, we do. We do. Yes, period. We have a new bridge. Mm. And guess what we have on the other side of this bridge? We have a work in progress. We have this slope going up, but we also have another slope going up and up there. Able sisters, we have been working our backsides off because trust, Lloyd the Gyroid has been getting dealt with. Periods, girl. Periods. Mm. Our house in the middle of the stream Because you know we built it in front of a waterfall. We have some places. We have some things. This is good Taking a look a Lot has happened, but a lot is still cool. We have crumb bed crumb bed. We have cloud strife and bayonetta artwork It's beautiful if anyone else is excited for Final Fantasy 7 remake. Just remember it comes out uh, the Friday after this episode goes up. Yay. You better play that tune. We got Diantha over here, because, you know, Pokemon Generations was the shit. Huh? We got Chrom on a canvas. We've got Alvis. And that's the main room. Okay, right. Down here. Into the back. 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 Hi, how have you been? I've not even asked you. We've been good. I've been good. I've been keeping myself sane during this entire lockdown period, because, you know... <coughs> People getting sick out here and it's not pretty. Oh my god. No, but seriously though, if you're sick and you caught it, girl, I'm sorry. But at the same time, you can't just go around licking everything and making physical contact with everything. This is why social distancing is good for you. This is why I keep myself to myself. So, uh, this place hasn't really changed that much either. Like, a little bit of furniture has been added. Uh, this is just like a chaotic storage room now at this point. Not a fan. But if anyone does try and rob me, I do have CCTV set up in this corner up here. Where is the down camera? There's the down camera. Hey, girl, how you doing? There it is. Right, so, let's actually have a proper eye island tour now. So you've seen the bridge, you've seen the ramp. Let's take a look in our shops next because that is what I want to do. I've not really had a proper good look in our shops today. And I think I saw when the game loaded, Flick was somewhere on the island, which is cool because this is actually the first time I've had him on our island. We have a new uh, telephone box and we have a signpost. This is good. This is very good. We've got all these peaches. And yes, look, I tricked everything out on the front of the town hall. We have drinks, snacks, bench, fountain. It's so cute now. I like it. Still got this signpost. It's really cute. Hey, Jose. Hey, Flick. How you doing? Let's have a chat. Uh, what voice do I give you? What voice do I give you? What voice do I give you? Uh... Uh, do you know what? You can beat Yorkshire boy. It don't matter how much I treasure it, folks. They'll never notice what I do for him. Oh, uh, sorry. Lost in my thoughts. Has the found any bugs yet? Because I'll buy any kind. Any kind. Oh, and if you want to commission a piece of my art, just let me know. Okay, bye. Uh, tell me about your art. Oh, I see. Time's come for we two travellers to begin this journey together. What bug have you chosen to act as that as your guide? Uh, the, 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 the common blue bottle. Hey, noble common blue bottle. Can you part with three of them? It's funny you should ask. They'll be happy and safe with me. Yes, please. Score the commission. I mean, uh, and so our contract is bound, human. Hold on, wait, no. He's, he's going to need an ego voice for that. And so our contract is bound, human. Or he could go for the mellifluous. 
And so our contract is bound, human. Already I feel the all-consuming fires of the creative inferno warming my becoldened blood. When I've completed my labors as midwife to the muse, I'll ship you the common blue bottle by mail. So I'm guessing that's like... Everybody gangster till the duck runs like Naruto. Bill! So we have a little thingy, we have a um, table with mugs and a climbing frame and some yellow roses and it's cute and some tires. Yay! It's really sweet, I like it. So! Museum. I'm slowly getting some furniture, it's really cute, it's whatever. Uh, purple and pink roses, and that's pretty much all we have to see here. Yes, it's the bunny day event. Well, the big- I hate- can I just say, I hate this event. There's too many eggs that happen in- there's too many eggs that I get in the sky. There's too many eggs that are in the water. And they're taking up places in my fossils. So... Shops. Shops, sir. Because we have more than one now. Look, okay, I don't care, but I will still shoot it down. Yep, yeah, too far away. Wow. Nice. That was great. What do we get? Oh, it's an egg into it, yeah. Oh, nice! I'm glad I shot that one down nice. Looks, what were you telling me otherwise? He already sends. Right, bunny day flooring. Can you get away from me, wee duck? Oh, my girl, it's my girl, it's my girl. What kind of fish I'm gonna meet today? I hope they're nice. Talk to me again. Perfect fishing weather. Time to catch a few fish. She's caught in tail. Right, next. That's all she's gonna do is she's just gonna wanna talk about fish. And I'm not about that life. I prefer sausage. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, okay. Nasty lemon ass settee. Right, what we got? A double sofa. 4,300. Do you see me? I'm broke as fuck. <laughs> Curious about what's in a cabinet. Uh, a bunch of shit that I don't really care about. And ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I made a promise to one of my mutuals that I said I was going to try something in this episode. So that, that just reminded me. Right, okay. And uh, what do I need? Okay, so ooh. Ooh. I like that. Okay, I'm gonna come back at 100. Right. I will come back at 100. What we got? What we got? What we got? Uh, I need to donate that turtle and I, need, I can sell all that other stuff. Right, okay, so I wanna sell. Here's what I would like. Right. Uh, sell, sell, sell. What we got here? Cardboard box. Yeah, sell that. Get rid of it. Get rid of it all. Goodbye. Right, 4,510. Gimme. Thank you. Right, okay. There was a thing that I'd seen on Twitter, and my mutual, Simon, hey, how you doing? <laughs> he said, oh, try the site in your next episode. So I'm going to, I'm going to give it one shot. Right. So this one's for you, Simon. There we go. Right. We're going to go find some bees. Or wasps, whatever. Right, okay. We have a slingshot. I don't want that. I want... Party popper. Right. Oh, hi! Money tree, I forgot about this. Right, what are we dealing with? 10,000? Oh, because I planted 30 and I'm getting 30 back. Yeah, I've noticed. It seems to happen on a pattern. It's weird. But now we've got 34,000, so that's okay. Right. Um, like, for instance, I could plant 10,000. No, sorry, I could plant 30,000 and I'll either get 90,000 or I'll get 30,000 and it seems to work on a day-to-day -day basis like I'll get 90, then I'll get 30, then I'll get 90, then I'll get 30 and I've noticed it seems to be doing it in a pattern. Right, I'm trying to find these bees. I'll speed up to that point. Be gone! Oh, it works. Okay, right, so here's Zell, our... I'm gonna go for a... I don't, I don't know whether to call it, like, Old East End or South African, so I'm sorry if the accent comes out as slightly racist, but we've had Jamaican Nook on this channel, so... Sorry, I'm on my break. <sighs> Just taking a breather, mate. 
Looking for a rap session with Zell, are you? Let's talk. Oh, is today Thursday? I always feel so spacey on Thursdays. It's like, the weekend still feels so far away, but the week's been going on forever. We really need a midweek weekend. Honestly, Mood. I like him. He's really cool. He moved in not too long ago. This is his place. Oh, and we got that ramp as well that you've just seen. It's really cool. Uh, we're going to get another ramp after that one that we've already got under construction is done. And it's going to go there, and then it's going to connect everything up together. And it's going to be cute! So, we. Because if you remember, this is the other side of that ramp that's uh, on the other side of the bridge for the house. Yeah, right. Up here, we have Able Sisters! Orange roses, orange roses, a lantern, a garden for Able Sisters, pink and purple roses, and then over here, black roses. I feel really good about how I've tricked this place out because my girls, Abel and Sable and Mabel, Abel, girl. Oh, we haven't talked to Sable today. Oh, we need to talk to her. Hi, how you doing? Sorry, I kind of have to focus on this so I don't wreck it. I love her. Girl. Hello there. Most of the stuff we carry is made here in the shop by my sister. Right, and she does a brilliant job. Oh, do you need the fitting room? Go ahead. This is peak Able Sisters. I'm just saying, look at everything we have to play around with in here. Right, okay, we're going to trick me out real quick. Right, uh, I want, can I go with that? And I would also, ooh, I could go with some pixel shades. They're really cute. I don't really like them though, so. Uh, what are we dealing with for bottoms? Ugh, we're not dealing with a lot, I can tell you that, yikes. Ooh, although, hmm, no. No, mm-mm. Mm, it's some glasses. I don't like them glasses. Hold on. Go to accessories, take that off. Go to hats and have a look here. We're gonna keep the hair. Uh, the glasses can go. The shoes can stay. Uh, girl shoes, girl shoes, girl shoes, and ugly boy boots. Nope, 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 no. No. Nope, okay, right. I think we're bored, with, bored of everything. Yep, sorry, girl. It's not happening. You don't have anything for me today. I'm not even kidding. On my first day that it opened up, which is two days ago at this point, um, I went through literally everything. Because the thing is, is I've been clothes starved in this game for like 11 days at this point. So their shop finally opened and I was beyond ecstatic. So here's Gabby Gabby's house. Girl, we don't care about you. Oh, actually, hey, you're here. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was talking mad shit about you. What's good, girl? Trust, you will be dealt with. I will push you into that river and hold your head underneath. I have an idea. Let's see how many more times we can talk to each other today, honey bun. I want to chat. The whole island's getting ready for Bunny Day. Isn't it the best? Want to know why I love Bunny Day so much? It's because the weirdest stuff happens. Like, if you stand next to a coconut tree and you give it a good smack, a load of wood eggs falls out. Candy eggs are growing on trees. That's bunny day for you, honey bun. Uh, no, that is the work of a madman in a bunny costume and I will not be told otherwise. What the hell is that? Locust? Oh, it's a locust. We don't care about that, it's whatever. Right. I could sell some fruit, but I just want to go down my list first. Right, so, money tree island tour, walk through the shops. Oh, current projects. Yeah, we've already done that. Right, play for the remaining half hour. Hehe. <laughs> I feel good. Oh my god. No. What chaotic evil. <laughs> oh no. 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 Right. Okay. Y'all need to stop this. I will sneeze on you all. There you go. Oi. Get over here. I need to pass my germs on. Marcel, I've given it you twice. Right, Bill, you can have it now. No, wrong emotion. There you go. Right, Mira, you're up. There you go. Right, everybody caught it. Everybody caught it. Everybody caught it. That's fine. <laughs> I'm a slime. Wait, what are you doing? You're going to knacker your net up doing that. Right. It's just, it's really fun. It's really relaxed. Uh... <laughs> Oh god, there's another one. Although we should check out that... What kind of Z-axis shit? Did you see how we're moving on a down diagonal? Bitch. Uh-uh. I ain't trying to have this.
We need to donate that turtle as well. What we got over here? White brick floor. Ooh, nice. We should check that out. We'll check out this turtle, we'll check out that floor, and I think we might just end up calling it an episode. I know it's a lot shorter. It's a lot, lot shorter. But honestly, I prefer like a shorter burst of episodes. Right, okay, uh, I want, like, I know what I'm trying to say. Like, if it's shorter, it means it's like, it's less editing and rendering. And then you can just get it uploaded pretty much straight away. So this is snapping. Oh, here we go. Okay. <clears throat> Blab this voice. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your snapping turtle? Yes, please tell me. Wonderful. I would love nothing more. The snapping turtle is a large turtle known for its crocodile-like body and long claws. No, wait. It is better known for its ferocious bite, which it can deliver with shocking speed for a turtle. No, wait, it is best known for the time it chased me across a car parking lot and I had to climb on top of a car. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Rest assured, all donations are displayed in a timely manner. You have my gratitude. You have my gratitude. And if you haven't seen our Fire Emblem Three Houses Let's Play, then you should do that. May the goddess Sothis bless you with her divinity. Okay, I'm going to take you through my museum because I kind of glazed over the... Um, the fish section in the last episode. So we caught a sturgeon. I know, I was blessed. The same day that I caught a sturgeon, I caught a coelacanth. I know. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that properly. I hope I am. So, snapping turtle. It's cute. Get in the water, swim about. Bluegill, black bass, kerb, koi. Koi was the other, the other rarity that I caught. I have no idea what's gonna go in that. But when something does go in that, it's going to be great. I have a feeling it's going to be Arapaima. Maybe even the Stringfish. I don't know. I'm not sure. Wow. Hi. I will say, I do think that that's the best one. The anchovy is the absolute best. Hey, sister girl, she online. I've been playing with my cousin for a bit. And it came to my attention that her town is... Um... Yeah, it's great. But... Girl, you need to play Animal Crossing a lot more. I'm, I'm calling you out on this now, Chloe. So we have Oliver the Oarfish, Frida the Football Fish, and Carl the Coelacanth. Or Celo the Coelacanth. Hey. Yes, she hurts right around. Can't sing that, otherwise I get copyright. <laughs> okay, right. Running, 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 dip. And here we are. Sea butterfly. I do love the sea butterfly. I don't know why, but the sea butterfly really reminds me of sea monkeys. Did anyone ever have sea monkeys when they were a kid? If you don't know what a sea monkey is, Google it. They're really, really like small things. And they kind of look like a sea butterfly. Hey! I didn't know you could do that. I didn't know you could stand in the middle of it and just have camera zoom out a bit like that. That's really cool. Mind you though, it was also this week that I found out that if you stand on a certain spot in the fossils bit, that the camera zooms out and then you've got this entire like shot of the meteor that was coming down to wipe out the dinosaurs. I'll write a comet. I'm gonna say meteor. Asteroid. Asteroid, comet, meteor. What is the difference? Oh my God. Anyways, let me talk you through these because we've had a couple of fossils get finished now. So we have this place, which we know about, that's fine, that's cool, that's whatever. We got the shark tooth, and we got the dinosaur track. It's really cool, I enjoy. It's looking nice, that room anyways. Here we have a bunch of the stuffs and things, and look, <gasps> things are really coming together. I'm gonna stand here, let this pan out, and then you can see pretty much everything. Look at the meteor. I can't wait for this room to be decked out with like the entirety of the Dinosauricus, stuff, stuff, and cuss, 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 cuss. Right, Spinosaurus. Don't care about that. Dinosaur track. That's all done. Right, T Rex. Cool. Right, but the one that we. No, one of the two that we fi finished recently. Deinonychus. Right? And then you've got Archaeopteryx. But then. I'm probably gonna end up butchering this as well. Uh, Pachycephalosaurus. I believe that's how it's pronounced. And Triceratops. And my ankle cracked. Ow. 
Oh, lordy. So this is actually the first episode that came out since Persona 5 Royal has come out. Are you guys playing it? Do you guys enjoy it? Is it too similar? Is it too different? What feels good? What doesn't? Talk to me about that. I'm very curious because I've got my copy on the way, but... You know, it's one of them games where it feels it's long enough where I don't know if I would want to do a Let's Play of that. I would probably rather stream something like that. But I've never done a stream, so I don't know what I'd be doing in a stream. Here's the mammoth. Here's the saber tooth. Yay. It's really cool. And then we've got this. We got the hip for the, oh, the butt end, the tail, whatever for this, for the megacerop. Megacerops. And then we've got Megaloceros. Fear the deer. If you don't fear the deer, then clearly you're not a fan of our Fire Emblem Let's Play because we've sided with the Golden Deer. Yay! Look forward to the next episode where we officially join the Golden Deer. Fear the deer. Right, let's have a quick look around the bugs because our butterfly house is bomb and I love it. It is, it's really cool. I really enjoy it. I think it's great. The bugs section is just mwah in this game. But then again, I'm like insane that the entire museum is just mwah in this game. Here we are. Bugs! Although I will say, April means new month. New month means new bugs or fish. So, I know that the Agrius butterfly is around. And I know that the, oh god, what's it called? Madagascar sunset moth? Madagascar moth, anyways, the green thing. There it is in the middle. Oh no, it's peacock. But look at it, it's so pretty. It's all so pretty. Right, peacock butterfly, tiger butterfly. Is that all you're really gonna show me? Come on. There are far more. Common butterfly, yellow butterfly, emperor butterfly. It's really sweet, I do enjoy this a lot. Right, okay, what we got? Common blue bottle, this is a new one for April. Agrius butterfly. It kinda, I don't know why, reminds me of like, the bisexual colors. And there's not a problem with that. So I'm gonna call that one the butter buy. <laughs> and then the ladybug, the girly bug, and then the schnool, the schnool, the schnell. That's the butterfly, the sunset Madagascar thingy. Moth. I think it's Madagascar sunset. Either way, it don't really matter. And there's not been any donations for this area, so we're not missing out in that one. Don't worry. Talk to me. Madagascan Sunset Moth, bitch! I'm remembering things, I feel good. I feel really good. Okay, uh, We don't really need to take a tour up there or along here. Do you know, I've not even gone on that many island tours. I've got the campsite. I'm now working towards getting the amount of residents needed for KK Slider to have a concert because at the moment, Isabel's like, oh yeah, we'll be able to invite him like at some point when our town's like about a three star rank. And I says, oh, what rank have we got? And she's like, currently we're on a one star rank. And I'm like, bitch, why are you lying? Oh my God, why are you lie? So I'm kind of like at odds with Isabel at the minute. Not a fan, don't like her. She's a bit evil. Oh, I wanted to check out that flooring, didn't I? Yeah. <sighs> this is why we love but hate Animal Crossing. I love it for the sense that I think it's great, and I get to do whatever I want. The bad news is, I always forget what I want to do. So, I'm going to, ooh, oh, oh, pleasantly surprised, I am at I. Hmm. Okay, right, here's what we'll do. Here's what we're really gonna do. Uh, not that. I want the colorful tile on, and I want to put that in storage, and I want to, change this entire shtick up. Huh, let's see. So yeah, I kind of went nuts with it. Uh, let's pimp me out. We'll go pink. Oh yeah, I didn't realize that this stylish jumpsuit were actually considered a dress. So I've been walking around with this on for like a while. <laughs> right, okay, worn out jeans, uh, glasses. Uh, we're gonna go with some I could go with these shoes. I don't know. Right. Um, I could, but that's all black everything. That's a nice sort of mix and match. I'm not really a big, big fan of it. Uh, let's just check our shoes again and see what we're rocking with. Because the thing is, is if we're going to wear the accessory of the bag and we've got the brown hair, 
we need brown footwear in order to sort of tie everything together because as long as you've got light and dark contrast between your top and your jeans, you're set. And that's coming from someone who used to be a stylist. Okay, uh, rubber toe high tops, no. Red, no. Green, no. Blue, no. No, no, no. Maybe. Actually, if I go white and then change the top, see that looks really, really, really cute, funnily enough. Right. Just go with the anorak jacket. That's really cute, actually. Sod it. No, we're going with this. That's sweet. But it's like smart casual, like if you're kind of going on a date, but like you don't want to be like overdressed, but this is this, this girl. Hold on, right. We're going to go bright pink socks and you won't be able to see them. But if I went and took the bag off, that's great. And then just change. Nope, nope. Oh, maybe. Oh! Oh! Hold up, hold up. Okay. Oh, no, that's me. That's me. That's exactly something I would wear in real life. That's exactly something I would wear. Again, something I would wear. But just see how simple you can make an outfit look. It's just, it's chaotic evil. Really, really simple, really, really effective. Styling tips. <laughs> And then we're just gonna make it chaotic lawful by having pink hair. So, that looks great and all. We're done with that. Mwah, beautiful. I look cute. Fix up this wig and we'll call it an app. Right, yes, I would like to change things up. Uh, press X to put this on. Eyes look good, haircut, here we go. Nope, mm, maybe. That's what we've just had, nope. No, no. Uh, actually, yes. And then if you wanted to, you could go chaotic or you could go sophisticated. Sophisticated, not catered. Right. Um, no, no. Huh. Unusual you, unusual you. No, 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 no. Oh, actually. Check me out, hold on. I kinda like that, to be honest. <laughs> okay, right. We have decked me out, we've accomplished absolutely nothing in this episode, and I am going to wrap it up here. So, I will love you and leave you. Stay safe, and have yourselves a damn good day. Goodbye.